Some of the comments in this Twitter thread are some of the cruelest things I've read in a very long time. Like, dude's a freak for real, and some other awful things I'm just not gonna repeat because they don't need to be heard by anybody. I don't even honestly believe you should go see this Twitter thread. Hey folks, so in a quintessentially 2020 style turn of events, and by that I mean confusing and depressing, a library worker who's recently gone viral for his doses of joy via TikTok videos is resigning from said library job due to constant harassment from online trolls. My last day at Solano County Library will be March 1st. I am leaving to prioritize my mental health to work with my mental health check-in team. Prior to this year's controversies, Michael, the librarian, as you note online, said he's been coming to the Fairfield Library since childhood. And with libraries making such an impression on him, it makes sense that he'd go on to become a librarian, with the wholesome content he made often being compared to something like uh, Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood or Reading Rainbow. So far, so good, right? Well, remember, we live in a country where the libs of TikTok lady can be elected to the Oklahoma State Library Committee despite not being a librarian or even living in Oklahoma. So soon enough, the far right started far writing, claiming that Michael gave off weird vibes or darkness and falsely claiming he has developmental disabilities. And while all of this, in my opinion, seemed like a setup to start throwing around rumor accusations, you know, the right's favorite word, Michael stayed positive, opening up about his mental health and responding to the trolls with empathy, even after the resignation announcement. And this might not be the last we hear from him, as there's rumors of a PBS collaboration. And what, are Republicans gonna boycott PBS? They already do that. Well, that's all for this week. In other news, what if somebody combined Fire Festival with Willy Wonka? Well, you don't have to imagine that anymore because it just happened. And yes, the cops were called. What is that? It's the end of it.